Zupa Toscana, but make it a skillet dinner. This creamy cauliflower gnocchi skillet has all the flavor you love from the classic soup, but it comes together in the form of an easy one pan meal. You're gonna be obsessed. The first thing we're gonna do is prep our cauliflower gnocchi. You're gonna wanna start by thawing them out if you're using frozen, and then all you do is toast them a couple minutes per side in a little olive oil until they're perfectly golden brown. Next, we're gonna start building that classic Zupa Toscana flavor. So I've started by softening some onion, and to that, I'm gonna add some Italian sausage. And you'll just wanna brown this up and break it into crumbles as it cooks. And now we're gonna punch up that flavor with lots of garlic, Italian seasoning, and crushed dried pepper flake. We'll add in some shredded kale. As soon as the kale is vibrant green, just like this, you can begin building that creamy pan sauce with chicken stock, heavy cream, and a little grated Parmesan. It smells so good. As soon as it comes up to a simmer, you're gonna add back in the cauliflower gnocchi and let everything mingle in the skillet for a couple of minutes just to bring it all together. You can serve it with whatever you love. I always finish it off with a little lemon juice, finely chopped fresh herbs, and some grated Parmesan. That is it. So much flavor, so little effort. You're gonna be obsessed with this one. So grab the full recipe on Plays All With Butter and be sure to give it a try soon.